Oh, you gonna sit up for mommy? You're sitting up for the camera? Woo! Woo! <laughs> <Wah! laughs> you are so cute, little girl. Wah! You're so cute. Okay, so TTW number four. Um, question number one is your engagement story. So my engagement story, um, I actually have already put up on Facebook. I put her um, on Facebook. I already put up on YouTube. Um, somewhere in Veda. I don't even remember when. It was somewhere in Veda, but I'll give you a brief rundown. So Vaughn was buying me something. We were both in job court together, and he was buying me something online for Christmas. And because I'm impatient, um, I had to know what it was. So I bribed his friend with a pack of cigarettes to tell me what it was. Um, lo and behold, it was an engagement ring. So I was not happy that I found that out because I thought it was just going to be, you know, whatever. I didn't think it was going to be an engagement ring. Um, and Vaughn was pissed. <laughs> so the date came in, which was uh, Christmas Eve. Um, he went down and he, from the mail to the mail place and picked it up and uh, because he already knew that I knew what it was he didn't go all crazy like he really isn't Vaughn's not very romantic we've learned that over the couple of years and I've learned to deal with this but Vaughn's not the most romantic creature he hadn't planned anything big or anything like that he was just gonna do it so basically what we did is we sat on this gazebo wall and he said look the other way so I turned my head and he goes, let me see if this ring fits. He pops it on my finger. This is the ring. Hopefully you guys can see that. That's the ring. Uh, popped it on my finger. And that was it. And then he stood up. And then I stood up and I was like, uh, is there something you were going to ask me? And he's like, oh, oh, oh yeah, will you marry me? <laughs> so that was exciting. So that's my engagement story. <laughs> Woohoo! Um, yeah, Vaughn's, Vaughn's not the most romantic, but that's okay. I still love him. Um, question number two is your three turnoffs when it comes to potential boys. In my case, boys. Um, number one, and people think I'm weird for this, but I used to have this ex-boyfriend who liked to cuddle with me on the couch, and he would like cuddle, and he'd like in my ear, he'd start singing, and he was terrible. Terrible. Now, I grew up very musically inclined. I play instruments, and I sing, and that's, you know. So, that right there, when, when people sing in your ear, and they can't sing, and it's even worse if they think they can, it makes, like, my, it's like nails on a chalkboard. It makes, nah. So, that's number one. And I'm not trying to be rude, you know. If you can't sing, you can't sing. Just get over it. <laughs> okay, number two. Um, when guys try to be, like, too overly funny, like, I, I don't know how to describe it. Like, it's one thing to be funny. Like, Vaughn is hilarious, but he's naturally just funny. But when guys are, you know, like, is that a mirror in your pocket? Because I can see myself in your pants. That right there just gets on my last nerve. I love to laugh, but that is irritating to me. Just boing. Number three is guys who are too full of themselves, who just giant egos where they can't get their head out of the door. Like that right there just makes my teeth hurt. I, I don't know, it's just weird. Like I just, you know, those guys that think they're all that in a bag of chips. Whatever. I'm retarded. Leave me alone. So yes, those are my three. Um, can't sing. I, not that I have an issue with not being able to sing. Just can't sing and try too much. Joke really horribly and way too much. And uh, over ego. Those, those are my three. And the last question is, is who would play you in like a romantic movie and who would play your love interest? Um, so I don't know if we're supposed to like, we're supposed to make it like who fits your personality and who fits your love interest personality the best. I don't know. But here's who I'm choosing. This is, this, these are my choices, okay? Uh, number one, uh, who would play me 
would definitely have to be Rachel McAdams. Because she's awesome. And I'm awesome. So it just works really well. Yeah. Rachel McAdams. Hot stuff. And who would play my love interest? There is no question about who this is. None whatsoever. I don't have 18 people I could consider. There's just one person. Just one. And that would be Alexander Skarsgård. I <laughs> love Alexander Skarsgård. I'm drooling right now. I want to apologize for my drool. Ugh. Oh, Alexander Skarsgård is so gorgeous! Gorgeous! Anyways, so that's TTW number four. Um, I will talk to you guys, er, guys, ladies, people. I will talk to you guys later.